the shallower this gets and the more sunlight it gets the slipperier it gets I like the word gets look at a brought I'm gonna be ready today what I want to do I'm gonna sweep this edge with that the last brim I bought broke then we're gonna go up to car parts spot and uh, sweep around All right, I tried that I didn't like the way it was going so I decided to come on one of the reasons I keep the camera going the whole time is because I want you to find something when I find it because if I turn the camera on and only turn it on when I find something that's incredible like everything I find ha huh. It's not as fun. But when we find it together, it's like cream cheese and cheddar. I did not wear my leggings today. You know, my little thigh highs because the degree is over 90 and it's just too hot for the hot tub. So we're gonna get up here to the sweeping spot and that'll be the ultimate grand reveal because you'll see it when I see it. I can't turn the camera off. I just want to sweep around. Hang my thing on top. I'm gonna start with sweeping this little washed out area and hoping the flat and fragrant stays. So there it is now. I will sweep it and it's gonna do that it's going to stir everything up and the goal is come back when we leave and we'll see what we've found hang on let me get this squished with a giant swisher well that didn't go as planned i swept it but then i dropped my camera in the water and then in the time i was drying off my camera it cleared out let's keep moving I was trying to remind myself why I brought my gloves and it's because I decided to go ahead and bring a magnet this time. Quickly remove all the F and N. Ferris and non ferris but I don't get anything and that's a clear sign man I forgot about this deep hole that is Ferris's day off so there's something shiny right there I want another nameplate for a car from a dealership or something I gotta climb around this. We're almost, almost there. Yeah, this may be the uh, lowest you've ever seen it. I'm thinking it's the lowest I've ever seen it, unless you've been here without me, which is fine. I'm not a spot boarder. I'll bring you with me. The transition between clay bottom and rocks and leftover silty, dirty stuff is where some things shine the most. But we're not going to play right here. Even though it looks so good. Come on, baby, make it look so good. I want to find. I know what that little metal plate is. And it may not be metal. 
is not. It is a piece of tile. So we need something flat and metal with words on it. Ooh, what kind of car did this come off of? Look at that door handle. Any ideas? That's neat, isn't it? That's back when even door handles had class. And it could be off a of deep freezer. But we are in Car Parts Creek. So there you go. Now this is where I've got to slow down a little bit because the water is shallow. The sun's kind of over our head, not all the way. Let's go up here. I guess we gotta stomp through all this. I just walked through something got ants love me. Hey, it's pretty awesome. It's kind of clouding up. Oh, and there's an ant about my neck. It's kind of clouding up and the wind's blowing. That's cool, isn't it? I'm trying to get all that ants off of me. This is a switching spot where we pulled a, uh, a coin out, that little tiny bus token, and a couple of keys, and then we found a ring in here before. Just a virtual myriad of variable plethora of items. That was my grown up talk. I still have ants on me. I got ants on my arm and they won't go. Insects on my arm and they won't go. I got one on the back of my neck too. It's, it's a little more disturbing. Because it's a train. We're almost there. If I could just get there and stop putting my toys down. I really want another badge off a car. You know, I'm talking about something that shows the dealership and all that. This is where we have swished and everything right here. Before we disturb the pre the premises, I thought I saw a ring, but it's not. Before we disturb the premises too much, let's take this. Just do kind of a GBL. That's a general. Hang on, there's a train. Yeah, this is gonna be it right here. That's where we're gonna pray. Pray, play. But first, let's check the other side. There's some chain in there. I'm 
might have to just deal with it and get my boots wet, huh? Hmm. No, I'm not going to. We'll find something. I brought gloves, I brought a magnet. And a few ants, just to keep me company. All right, let me get prepared. First thing we're gonna do is remove some big stuff. The big rocks, the big everything that's in our way. And I guess I'll just sit it to the side because we may fill the hole back in so it can catch something else. And then we're going to sweep it ever so gently. Ingersoll Rand. Plow point. Actually a uh, piece off a sickle mower. Now let's do this side. everything in this pile and if we don't find anything it's because there's nothing here That's kind of a good start, huh? Let's uh, sweep it. And then uh, we'll look and see what we may have missed. There's a BBF, big brass faucet. Okay, I'm gonna sweep this and hopefully it'll clear it up a lot. I swept the bottom pretty good. Now I'm just trying to get all the uh, dusty water out of the way. There's not a lot of flow. So we're gonna give it a boost. Still not real clear. I'll tell you what's neat, I got a pretty good little scratch on the back of my leg getting down here. I think that will help. See, here's a bunch of little bitty stuff. This is where we kind of want to be. I don't see anything that's uh, name tag ridden. But, Inski, we're gonna look for coins. Can you see down there? Oh my goodness. Sorry about that lacking. Let's try this again. I can't even remember if I turned you off or turned the thing off. I know you wonder what that is. That's an ice cream truck.
It's amazing how much my person makes sweat bent over plan in here. There is a lot of lead. You want to go under and watch? Might be easier for us all. Then if it's not, the problem is you won't see anything. See, I could use my magnet, but it would immediately wad up with stuff. We need that block moved and to get around that chain and everything. Let's do that. I cleaned off my lens. Sorry about that. I uh, swept this. I changed my mind on the other spot. I just want to get to the lowest point down here everything would gather then we'll look I know you need to go under so you can see what's going on let's go goodness gracious I may as well we may as well do that huh
go from there. Let's try it right here. Move stuff over. We need a channel for the dust to flow.
I gotta go. But we can uh, peek around. I got your glasses off. I need the lens to dry. Let me work on that for a second. Hey, things in the dryer. Maybe that got it. The exit up here is a little challenging. But what did we find? Two libraries? <laughs> a lot of work for two libraries. I bet. Hope you didn't get too hot. We could possibly find something on the way out. There's some cool things in there. It's just... It's tough. It's like when you go metal tech and you find one thing that's absolutely amazing in one spot or two or three in one spot and you think, man, I gotta go back there. And you go and you spend hours and hours and hours and you don't find anything else. So I stare at the bank on the way back. Then I'll fall down.
guess we're about to pass the spot where we swept a few minutes ago. It's actually been a, an hour ago in my life, in your life, it hasn't been that long. Unless I passed it. Looking for the button. I think that's the spot we swept. I can't tell. We've disturbed everything so much upstream. It's hard to tell. Break, wipe the lens off again. That's toasty. I don't know if you've ever been to Birmingham, but there is train after train. And to train. Oh, something kicked the bucket right here. I don't know where it is. Well, my lens is starting to fog up again. So I think I'm done. Thanks for going with me. Hope you had a good time. Okay, one more peek right here. Okay, thanks for watching my videos. Wait a minute, I'm looking for the off button. There it is. 